Let the message of Christ dwell among you richly as you teach and admonish one another with all wisdom through psalms, hymns, and songs from the Spirit, singing to God with gratitude in your hearts. And whatever you do, whether in word or deed, do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through Him. Hello and welcome again to another edition of 5 Minutes. It's the show where we give uplifting and inspirational information to help you through those hard times. Our families mean a lot to us. Families grow and change though. But the love that they have for each other always remains the same. You and I may not know or understand all the reasons why God allows certain things to happen. We don't know why He allows certain things to come in between us. He doesn't promise us that, but He does guarantee us this, that whatever we face in life, He's going to be with us because those of us are His children. Growing up means a whole lot of changes. Those you were once close to as we get older, we grow away from. Once you were closer than closer or thicker than these. But again, time has a way of changing those things. Life is all about perfect balance. But since nothing in life is perfect, we have to do the best with what we've got. Change can be uncomfortable and be difficult in the beginning as everyone has his own story. But you must not lose faith in each other. When you find yourself doubting one another, remember how far you come together. Think of the times that you shared, the moments when you laugh and cry together, the moments of joy and those of pain. Life is about change and change is a part of life. Every day may not be a good day, but there's good in every day. Every family has its ups and downs. They have their moments of anger, division, or fracture. And sometimes we get too busy, we quickly fall into despair. But remember, accept nothing less than God's best. One of God's greatest gifts is the gift of family. There's no feeling in the world like coming home and fun family memories send you off and greet you again with a warm welcome when you return. Our family are like the compass that guides us. They are what keeps us focused on the road of hell. They are the inspiration we need to help us to reach the great heights in our comfort when we fall. They can be our rock that keeps us strong and on path. And when trouble arises, it's family that gives us support. So again, things change. And as the writer in Ecclesiastic states, to everything there is a season, a time for every purpose under heaven. There's a time to love and a time to hate, a time of war and a time of peace. Love your family. Spend time, be kind and serve one another. Make no room for regrets, as tomorrow is not promised, and today is short. Well, that's my time tonight. I pray that you all have a blessed week. Remember, make time for each other and your family. One love, five minutes.